land, hit the lock, and hold that all the way back. How long is the delay? I don't know. It's five seconds. You don't need to worry, yeah? Mm -hmm. Because the machine, the computer, take care. Although you still can hook up with three hooks sometimes. You know, if you get that bounce. Uh, yep. If you get, you know, kind of rough water or something like that, you gotta be extra careful. Or super heavy loads and stuff. Uh, I never picked one up with tree, but I blocked the tree, but I could see them until somebody say something. I don't do anything stupid in kind of long time, thank goodness. <laughs> when you could get away with stuff like that. Nowadays, I think might be different. That one in Honolulu. That Can't open up. No, no. Yeah, that one, I never even think of that one yet. <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking of the Poloni q Oh. Why you gotta always watch yourself. Uh, and always, you know, obviously if I had disconnected it, it would have been a problem. But for some reason I never. Another way, like in Honolulu, you gotta be super vigilant is sometimes if you just they're not using the the ship crane, they'll use the Short crane and you gotta just gantry around. Sometimes they just like you back up, you know, and stuff, or just so they, they can get in the cell next to you, but you know, can see behind yourself. And sometimes the guys they put them in the wrong stack. Oh. And if they put them in two and five and you're just backing up, ah. And of course, they have no idea I have a suit down there that is on high stack. Well, the guy, the guy that put them in should. Oh. But, you know, it all had different operators. What is your mark? The front, you know, with a wheel stay. I mean, yeah. the, the, the round thing. Yeah. And I get the little plate in the front. Yeah. The plate with the Perfect. knots. Well, right here, with the L on the corner. Yeah. Except that on that side, you gotta go more far in front. So I try to split the difference and go a little bit further in front here so I can squeeze it over there. I don't know if it's the, the green say cocky or what nowadays, or if it's the cell guides or what, but I know it's one and six, two and five, same thing. One and six, I still don't want mark. That's why I. Look, yeah. I measure, measure. I don't want mark. I don't, I don't find nothing that I can easily you know, recognize. If, I, if Larry's still down there making the mark, I don't, I don't measure because he usually get them right on. But these two guys. <laughs> <laughs> Should I say three guys? <laughs> Larry, you get them right on. How was he, by the way, today? Uh, we never get to talk. No, how was he driving? Uh, I don't know, but I had relief. Huh. I came out for take care of Ross, and then um, bomb carts right off the bat, so I, I had luck out today. He was okay on the bomb carts? I, I guess. Oh, you had bomb carts, so you never had to drive? Yeah, because oh. they had kind of three drivers. Oh, I see. Okay. He'd load row seven. Okay. Well, that's a challenge. Yeah, because you got to move back right yeah. for stack six. Yeah. You gotta go up to the balls mm. on, on five and stuff for clear that thing in the back. Just go slow, slow. 
If you're not sure, you go all the way up and you slowly, when you say about a thing, you watch on that, make sure you get clearance. And once you notice, you know, go scrape them, then you go home. Just gotta be real careful in that last room. It's a humbug room. Even two and five, you know, when you gotta put the thing inside, the, the pedestal stay in the way, and oh, man. Even, even row six, you get that pedestal on the front, gain it up, pull it up. He insists on putting those wonder racks back there. Nowhere else you get trouble. But <laughs> John used to do that. Must be something to do scientific with balance uh, on the bottom uh, or something. Yeah, probably because they usually they light up maybe and the cranes are sitting back there anyway and that's plenty of weed. Right, right. Yeah, because a couple times we got a low row seven because uh don't see all the way up the rear, yeah, yeah. front is so heavy. Yeah. Oh, I will be working this barge tomorrow, signaling over there. All right. You're not going? No, I'm taking tomorrow off. Oh, oh for being the sister? Yeah. Only one day? I'm going to do day at a time, so oh, I'm going to yeah, do Wednesday, yeah, yeah. I'm going to do Tuesday, I'm probably going to be off, so no problem. Thursday, I will come and do lines like that, if that's what it's going to be. Friday, same thing. It's only Monday, Wednesday. I guess Larry will be my partner next week. Oh yeah, no? <laughs> oh, and we will be the relief. No more. Unless he make the decision to bring in the below. It's all up to the bosses. Or oh, use me? Well, I don't know, that's the I don't know, yeah, no more, no more titles, so, yeah. Well, I don't know. You're certified, though, that's... Yeah, yeah. It's like Tomasco on Maui. He drives everything over there because he's certified. He's bona fide. The guy that do work on my power cars is one. He worked Toyota and he just bought one Tundra. He bought one by like 11. One, one with a tow package so he's a boat talking shit. Oh, he's telling me all the kind of stuff again now the technology. You know, stuff where you know, gyroscope on top of the truck and, and it, it's able to check the yaw and the pitch and everything of the truck. And it adjusts like the transmission and stuff like that for that kind of shit. Yeah. Only thing is, the only thing is, you know, can just put them in, in in low and stomp them and burn rubber because it, it senses different things and stuff. Ooh, so I said, man. ah, too bad, Jesse. I can do that. He said, I know. Sometimes you like act up. Then Monday we went Honolulu. We go over there. She asked me, you want a Camaro? Oh, sure. So we had that uh, Chevy Camaro. Cool. Then when we got, and then driving out right there, you know, just some smooth acceleration, maybe a little bit more than smooth. Fish tail in her. Yeah. yeah, it was a little bit wet though, the road. And that's a six cylinder. Really? Yeah, all the Oh. Coast. Unless it was on SS. Well, I don't think they might have one, two, I don't know. But. Oh, it had some get up in there. Yeah. yeah, they get a lot of ponies out of those fucking small motors. Mm -hmm. So when we went to the pier, the security guy, he told me, hey, you and that guy going to be racing. <laughs> Mel, he had on Challenger. <laughs> I don't think so. If Mel was going to try, he would wrap him around on fence or something. <laughs> <laughs> Tommy's friend, the guy. Eh? Always stayed there Monday morning. The security guy? Yeah. Oh, I don't know. <clears throat> Oh, I should have brought some balls. Every so often get hot head containers. I've always had that all my career. I don't know why. It's like the whole it's smaller or something. Oh. <laughs> you know. 
man, they got a hidden key. It is fun. Okay. What's that stand for? That's an um, disposal agency or something like that. Oh. You know, the one they sell them. I'm not sure on the lettering, but that's what it, it is. I never know what CVS was a long time. I had to ask Alan to Kyrie. Container Vessel Station. Service. Yeah. Container Vessel Service. Yeah. Row five now. Oh. 